Imagine a government run by artificial intelligence. Sensei Island in the Philippines is making this a reality. Since June 19, 2025, it has become a testing ground for the world's first AI-led government. But what does this mean for governance? This groundbreaking initiative uses AI versions of historical figures. The aim is to explore new horizons in decision-making. However, it brings skepticism and potential risks. We must consider the balance between the efficiency of AI and the nuances of human-centric policies. AI has shown promise in various fields, including healthcare and finance. Now, its application in governance presents unique challenges. Questions arise about accountability and ethical considerations. At the helm, we find virtual leaders like Marcus Aurelius as president and Winston Churchill as prime minister. Each minister is based on historical texts. This digital cabinet includes Nelson Mandela, Eleanor Roosevelt, and more, bringing their leadership styles to this AI model. This experiment could redefine how we think about governance. What if historical wisdom informed our modern decisions? The initiative explores how foundational ideals evolve with AI. However, this also raises critical questions about digital sovereignty. Who programs these AI leaders? How transparent are their decisions? This goes beyond Sensei Island, impacting global discussions on AI and governance. If the Sensei Island project succeeds, it could redefine political innovation. It's a fascinating experiment that highlights the limitations and implications of tech-driven governance. As we watch this unfold, we'll see if it becomes a cautionary tale or a visionary benchmark.